Oh, what's up, everyone? This is Dark Sky, and we are continuing on playing Incremental Factory. Uh, I mean, this is one of those games where you just can't seem to put down. You know, you pick it up, and it's just, you know, it's kind of addictive. I ain't gonna lie. The uh, we have, uh, I, you can see that I did a little bit of more, you know, a little work on it, uh, trying to increase it. Uh, it tried to see uh, if I can, you know, add a little bit more to it. I uh, Everything is, seems to not be in the process of moving because I imagine that it is completely filled over here. We have all kinds of science. We have all kinds of uh, resources and everything. So we are in kind of a limbo at the moment. Uh, we have the research here. I have research uh, to unlock. Uh, I can unlock the uh, research parcel for 800. And then we can unlock new... Uh, was this new resource by digging deeper with uh, excavation site? Unlock new resources. Okay. Let's do that then. And that puts me at about 852. I, um, and that should actually increase really fast. So I should be able to get that last one, but we need to work towards getting the green, the green, uh, the, the green tubes. We have quite a bit to do, and you can see it takes it all the way down here to oil processing. So let me see here. What is it we have to do here? We need to get this green going. We have everything but that. Just pumping out, you know, doing this thing. Oh, yeah, that's right. We needed copper cables to make that. Hmm. Are we even making copper cables yet? Let me see. Oh, see, we on the got to the spot where we can actually unlock the next per portion the last portion if you will of the uh the red um resource uh let's see to reduce the energy consumption of buildings by four percent that's gonna be nice it's not huge but it'll be nice so let's get back here now uh, all we're gonna be doing mostly is focusing our energy on trying to get this uh the green going so what we need to do is a set up copper. I want to go through here. Now, I want to go through here and kind of, uh, let me continue with that. You know, I, I got so many thoughts, so many things are going on in my head. And I think what I want to do is I want to look to see what I have. And then I want to color code it so that that way I can get kind of a better feel for like what's going on here. So if we scroll out a little bit, you can see how it changes, how everything is and what what is being processed. You know, what is its main process going through? So we up here we have stone up down here. We have our iron, lots of iron here, uh, more stone brick. And then we have um, the uh, iron plates that are being made here. And then we got three of them that are gears and one that's steel. And then, of course, the red. So if we were to go up here to this, say, and say we just pick this color, this third color here as for our stone. So we choose that one, choose that one for our stone, and we just consider this whole line, the, uh, the stone one. This one here is already chose good. All right, so we got that one as stone. Now this one here is for steel. Now we need to figure out, well, no, this line here isn't steel. This line here is just on its own. So I'm thinking maybe, what do we got here? This one here is choosing this one here, this gray, and right next to the pink for for um, just iron plate. Let's do kind of the light gray. And so I think that's already the light gray, isn't it? Well, it is now. And then we'll choose this one. There we go. We'll choose that one there as the uh, light gray. There we go. We got So we got that whole line going. Now steel, I'm thinking since everything is steel, I want to go with uh, is a good color for steel. Um, let's do this one right next to the neon green. That uh, looks like a nice color for steel. That way we get kind of a everything on the same line. That way I can just look at it and be like, hey, 
that's the steel line that's the steel line that's the one that's causing us issues we need to uh, fix that issue and um, go from more forward from there now it would be nice if there was a way where we could instead of opening up each one and then choosing the color that we could just choose the color from outside or you know maybe there's oh like a um a paint can or something like that where you, we just paint the uh the little little knob or whatever but you know the game being as simple as it is you know i'd imagine that's you know the this is probably about the best bet you're gonna get all right so next what we got down here is gears and so the gears i'm thinking uh let's do like this um well, I color right here next to orange that'd be a good one kind of a salmon color i guess yeah so we'll do the salmon color for gears and there we go get that one going no that's not it it's the next one over there we go and i want to do this one here and lastly is the gears one now the last one i think i want to do since this is a red the uh red science pack <laughs> obviously i'm going to do red that just yeah you know it just seems like that's just what what to do so we're going to do red here And then for the green pack, you know, I'm thinking maybe like that neon green, that'd be kind of neat. All right, so next what we need to do is, is there like a way for us to do copper? Because I do not see like a copper miner here. So I'm not sure how we go about doing that. Ah, uh, here we go. So now what we have to do is we're at currently at ground level, but we need to beat level one and that unlocks our copper ore, copper plates and copper cables. That's what we need to do. So let's dig that. I totally dig that. <laughs> All right, there we go. We unlocked it. We got copper ore, copper plates and copper cables. Nice. So let's go back to our map now and let's see what do we have to do to uh you can see it just unlocked a whole bunch of uh, stuff for us to do here so we need to make a uh, copper miner um so i'm thinking i i don't need to have the uh, copper um uh, resource come here oh that's weird how it's all shrinking so I'm thinking what I want to do is I want to do uh, do the copper miner with a copper smelter, and then and I want to bring the what maybe the copper plates. Can we do that? Is there copper plates? Because I don't see that as a thing. So here I want to do is I want to do a copper miner. So I'm bringing in the copper miner. I want to bring in uh, the coal miner. And I need to have the uh, the coal power plant. All right, so I have those going on. Now I need to upgrade the uh, the coal miner. Let's do like seven, maybe six. I think it's six. And for copper, I'm going to do like this little orangey color here. And let's see here. So I have copper here, and then. I want to do the uh, the production, so the I'm probably going to do a node as well, so I can kind of stay in what I'm doing here. We're going to bring that across here. That's going to be the copper ore, and then here what we're going to do is we're bringing the copper ore over. So we need to have the copper smelter, which means we make copper plates. Uh, see, I thought that's what was going to happen. And so I think what I'll do is I'll do the copper plates and I'll do the coal miner with the coal power plant. There we go. And we'll bring up the that 
to what, eight. Uh, let's do eight. There we go. That should be good. We need to bring up the coal miner a little bit. There we are. All right. So we should be doing pretty good there. So we'll bring this across here. This is going to bring across the copper ore. And then we're going to take the copper ore here and we're going to take this. How do you do it with? There you go. And take that and we're going to put that up there and that's going to be our copper plates and then what i want to do now is i want to actually go in here and change this um which color was it was it that one no it's not that one it is what fifth from the left so this one here Okay, so now what I want to do is I want to copy this, and then I want to drag that. Couldn't drag it all there. All right, so bring these down here, and it's weird how it didn't really keep the colors, you know? But that's okay, because actually, you know what? What I want to do is I want to change this color here, because this color here is actually going to be um, the copper... Uh, Blue copper coils. So we're going to change that out. So we have that. And so we're going to have this go into a, another production module here. And this one here is going to be the copper cables, copper extruders, sorry. So we have that. And then we have the coal power plant with the, uh, the coal miner. They need it pretty much in all of them, but this guy here, he in order to make these cables, we need the energy and the cable plates or copper plates to make the copper cables. It's weird it calls it cable extruder here, but on here it may it calls it copper cables. So and a little confusing. So there we go. We got that going on. Uh, let's see here, and we got that there, all right. Uh, no, this one here is supposed to be this one. All right, so this one comes across here. This is going to be the copper plates that we're bringing across. And then this is going to be... It's going to be copper cables that's going to come into our main headquarters there. So we got uh, quite the mix going on here. I'm thinking what I want to do, maybe just bring that down like this so I can kind of see that a little bit better. Uh, now that we got eight coming in here, everything seems to be, uh, you know, grooving and whatever, getting in there. We need to uh, make the green one, which requires us to make, where is the green one? There it is, which means we need, we need bricks, we need energy, and we need cables. And then we make the green science. Oh, man, that's a lot of stuff. So let me see here. We are going to do... Um, let's see, we need... We need the cables here, so they're right there. We're also going to need the bricks, which is means that we're going to need this one here. And I think we just need one line. We don't need that second piece. Dang it, that did not work as bad planned. Let me try that again. Why does it do that? It's weird. It's not supposed to bring the whole thing at once like that. See, it's supposed to do that, but it doesn't. It's it's kind of separated the two. I don't know why. Yeah, we'll just go into here and delete that part. So we don't need that one. We just need this piece right here. We'll hit that. And then we'll drag that. Oh, now it seems to work. Why? Okay. Hmm. 
delete that, delete that, delete that. All right, let's see here. Let's try it again, Sam. There we go. So I want to bring this down here. So that is going to be that piece there. That is going to be our stone. Right, that's our brick. Yes, that is making brick. Okay, good. Just not making brick at the moment. I don't know why. Build in coal. Cannot afford the building cost of 10 stone. Why not? Why can't it not do that? Okay, well, anyways. It's uh that's what it's doing. It's got um the kiln down down here, so it shouldn't be coal. Let's change that to that is supposed to be brick. So yeah, that should be making eight brick. It's not transferring anything at the moment because it's probably filled on the other end. funny over here it shows that everything's fine dandy you know that kind of stuff so it should be fine oh i see it's only got one stone though that's probably what it's talking about i don't know why because it should be making its own yeah that's what it is how silly is that Uh, let's see here. What else we need to do? We, so we need to do that. And then what's the other stuff that we have to do for our green? Uh, we need copper cables. We got the bricks and the energy is going to be part of the line anyway. So we don't need that. So let's do this here. Let's try that again. There we go. So I want to put that down here, take that offline there, and then I want to do a uh, production. Yeah, let's put it right there. So this one here, this production is going to be the neon green, and it's going to be our green science. So we're going to put in one green science. We're going to put in one coal miner and one power plant. So these ones here, I wonder if there's a way where I could just highlight all these. No. It'd be nice if I could highlight them all and then just paint them all one color. I was trying to find, you know, kind of some kind of a little sneak around, you know, to where we can, uh, you know, do all the painting and colors and stuff like that without having to go into each one of these and open these up and, and paint them. If you happen to know if there is a way around it, you know, comment down in the comment section. Let me know uh, if there is a way to, like, uh, you know, change that up a little bit. So we're going to do this here. This is going to be the, uh, the copper cables. This here is going to be the bricks. I should have done that a little bit differently, but it still it changed it around for me. So awesome. And then ultimately, this is going to come up here, and this is going to be my green science. So you can see I'm not really producing a lot right now. Not even producing 0.5. Well, barely. I'm barely doing 0.5. Just need to up this a little bit more. Uh, looks like we're going to need some more copper cables coming in. We're only doing, what, 48T? Even our bricks are a little on the light end. Uh, but I see the number going up. The number here is, it's, it's struggling. But we are not getting any higher on this here. So we need to, like, uh, see if we can't up that a little bit. Uh, see how we're doing bricks. We're doing pretty good on coal. We got definitely a lot of coal power coming in, so we're fine there. 
Uh, it looks like we're struggling like right in here somewhere. I mean, we are doing good on the on getting uh, the coal or the copper. I mean, getting the copper to this point. But once it gets to this node, then it seems to be struggling a lot. So much a lot. So maybe what we need to do is pull off another one here. So there we go. We have quite a bit of uh, copper coming in. We got two resources of copper coming in here. Shooting in, giving us 16. It is mostly refreshing most of it. This is going all the way up to eight here. This is not getting any further ahead on copper cables. My God, is that not the case? We should be like just moseying through it. Let's see, we got the copper smelter here. Copper ore is coming in. It seems at 17, we're doing 16 at a time. I see my copper plates are slightly going up, so. But we're only forcing out like 4T. And it doesn't seem, it seems like the max is 4. Can't seem to up that. Oh, yeah, we can up that more. But it doesn't seem like that is changing the uh, the scenario at all. Let's see, we up the coal miner. Coal miner is actually maxed out. Um, I'm thinking it might be a good idea to copy this whole scenario here. Maybe this scenario, because this one here is only doing four at a time. I prefer it to do eight, but it seems like it's doing pretty good here. Just it, when it gets to this point here is when it's also struggling. So I'm not getting as many uh, cables as I'd like to have. Uh, so what if I take this here and you know, copy that and you know, bring that down here. And so now we're going to do this one here is going to be our, um, I wish it would change, keep the color, you know, haven't they like go through and change all the colors out? It's kind of, uh, kind of ridiculous to be honest. So let me see you do that one there. There we go. All right, so now that's doing eight. These are both doing eight. We're finally getting up to one, but I don't think that the stone bricks are coming through as uh, nicely as they should. Uh, let's see here. Let's uh, bring these down a little bit. Yeah, bring them down to about, yeah, right about there. That looks good. And then I want to bring this here, and I want to copy that and bring that to here. I want to double my brick intake. I think that might, that might kind of solve our case. I'm hoping that's, what it, that's the case. All right, so we have that coming in. Uh, let's see, what's that doing? Why is that only 6.14? Stone, stone is struggling, but it's not struggling too much because I mean, you can see we are, we are maxed. We are maxed on coal, but we're only bringing in like 5.71 roughly. Now we're not bringing in any, obviously, because it's, uh, I imagine this is probably maxed out. Yeah, bricks, bricks are maxed out. The cables, on the other hand, even though they're bringing in what it looks like 16. Still a little on the struggle side, on the struggle bus there. What was that? Was I, no, I was looking at this here, wasn't I? So I was doing 0.5 times the coal equals 16, the energy. That's requiring 2.88. I may even produce even that much more. But we have unlocked a few resource items here. Uh, looks like we have already made 400 or so of the green. So we can increase our edge throughput 
to 16 times uh, uh, items per click. I think right now our max is eight. So that would be a huge upgrade. Let's do that. You search that. There we go. Unlocks machine gun turret and walls. So that would be a kind of a neat deal. Uh, let's see here what, what that looks like now. Uh, you can see some of these, like this one here is at 16 per second. That one's a 16. This one here says 20 per second. But these ones here are at 16 per second, so they seem to really be pushing towards the green. But this here is, uh, it seems to be kind of our, um, our problem, a little problem shot, if you will. I mean, I see the number going up slightly. Huh. I'm almost thinking if I need to bring in more copper cables, because I'm not... This number doesn't doesn't look as pretty as I would like to have it. I would like to have it a nice little pretty number. Um, I'm wondering if I did if I did a node. What if I did a node here, huh? So let's change the node to the green. And instead of this going here, we're going to have this go up here. I'm thinking this is my change things. So that's the cable. And this one here, we'll have that one go in with the cable. And then we'll bring this up here with the uh, more cable. So that way we should really be able to ramp what, what we got going on here. Thinking maybe even just doing that same over here. So I'll take this line out. Come on, there, there we go. And that line. And I want to do this one here. And I'll do bricks. This one here is going to be also bricks. This is going to come across here as bricks. All right, so this one's doing a lot now. I like doing, uh, oh, it, was, it ramped up to like 37 there for a second. This is says it's doing like 32 per second, so that's actually pretty decent. Still a little on the iffy side there, not getting the numbers I like. I mean, this is roughly about a 3.0 as far as green sources, uh, but we are getting quite a bit of research. I mean, we're currently at 800 and we seem to be going up by about eh, two or three a second, which is about right, because that's how much we're pushing across there. So that's not too bad. I mean, it wouldn't be a bad idea even to push out maybe even a little bit more, you know? Um, let's straighten those out a little bit. Okay, so there we go. That looks a little bit prettier. Everything is looking a little bit nicer there. Um, I'm thinking that uh, it might be even a, in a better interest. I don't know if we can do it. I don't know if this is max, 32 per second. What happens if I, um, I mean, I'm pushing out, what is it, like three per second there? Uh, let's do, let's copy this and let us do another copy of this down here and see what kind of numbers we get. I think we can even do more. There we go. Okay, that's ramping up to the 16. This is going to be up to about what, 48? 48 per second. Now we're doing about four per second on this. So you see, like, for us to get this up to about eight per second, like I, I like. Oh my gosh, we're going to have to almost ramp this. This won't actually be able to go up another, another bit because, um, 
I think this wrap uh, maxes out at like 60. All right, so now that we have that going and we have quite a bit of green science, we're at like 1300 green science now. Pretty good. We unlocked the blue one here, but the blue one requires silicone, a gen one chip, and a lot of energy. Well, we haven't unlocked silicon or what the Gen 1 chip is. I don't even know what those are. That's, they're talking another whole nother language to me there. So we'll go into research here. We can unlock our machine gun turrets and walls. Uh, with that unlocked, now we can go up to our excavation site here. And we can do, I believe this is the bullet, is the guns. So we can put out a turret. We can put turrets out here. Oh, what's a what, missing, missing bricks by 1,000. Huh. Okay. Well, let's see what, what kind of bricks. How about this here? Uh, wall. Where does it say, uh, I see rock here. I see bricks at uh, 2,500. Okay, so that uses bricks there. And then what, maybe something like that right there. Uh, let's see here, I don't want to do this. Let's How do you take it out? Nope, not that one. Maybe this one here. Oh, I guess we can move it. Let's do that. Well, I guess we'll move it, huh? Oh, delete all walls. Okay. Well, I don't want to delete all walls, but okay. Uh, let's do one here. We want to put one up there. Maybe some down here. Um, I'm thinking maybe have a turret right there and right there. Do something like that. There we are. And then in those empty spots, we'll put the turrets. What does it say? Uh, it needs to have floor there first. Okay, that makes sense. All right, uh, let's see here's the turret. And with the turret, it says we're missing bricks. So it's saying that we need these uh, these bricks, but it currently, I mean, we're at like 800 here. And you need 3,500 just to lay down one. So if we go back to the map here, you see bricks right here. I think what we're gonna need to do is up this so we can really just maximize what we're going on. This here, I don't understand what's going on. I think I can delete this. I don't need that. Let's take that out of there. And let us see here. We're gonna do that and we're gonna copy and bring up another one. And I don't know why it did that. Uh, let's see, I guess it's that one there, isn't it? I don't know why it pulled that one. It was just supposed to pull the first one there. Uh, let's see here. And then let's do a node. Bring the node in here. And I'm thinking maybe just bring it in like right there. Take this out put that up there for the bricks this will go in there for the bricks and ultimately this will come down here with the bricks there we go so how are we doing on bricks now yeah we're almost up there we almost got enough but actually no we don't how is it we're going to have enough bricks? Because I max is only like 2,500 on bricks. And it said we needed like 3,500 to set down a uh, um, one of those um, uh, turrets. So I don't know how that's going to work out. See, I guess we need stone, maybe a uh, 
iron miner, maybe a copper miner. We might have to like set these up. I didn't realize that the uh, we needed actually um, those little miners like that, like these little stone miners and copper miners and iron miners. So I don't know. I guess we might have to set those up somewhere. So that should be going full bore there. Now let's see if we can put that down. No, still can't. It says 2,500. But it says down there at the very bottom of that turret, it says it cost is 700 of the of the uh, steel and 3,500 bricks. How do you make, how do you get 3,500 bricks? There must be something that we need to upgrade or something like that. Oh, you know what? Because it's 2,500, right? So we need to uh, set up a uh, warehouse. That's what it is. I bet you that's what it is. That makes sense. So, and we don't have, um, let's see, cost of one of those. Hmm. We don't have the, yeah, uh, it says building zero. Resources inside warehouses are globally available. If you pay for building construction and research, all warehouses share the same storage each warehouse increases total capacity okay so we get another uh capacity of 2000 but how do you unlock the uh the ability to use the warehouse i mean it's grayed out at the moment increase warehouse capability to 3500 okay well let's see if that will unlock the um warehouse why is that uh, unlocked warehouse Okay, but anyways, yeah, I think uh, we'll uh, just kind of work with that and see what happens. Maybe it'll just unlock after a while. I don't know. Not sure how that uh, how we get that to unlock. Oh, there it is. It finally unlocked. What made it unlock? Maybe it was because we uh, got a two thousand stone or something. I don't know. But uh, I think we'll uh, we'll tackle that on our uh, next uh, attack here. And uh, thank you very much for coming out and joining me on this. This has been an absolutely fun game. I've been enjoying it. And just having you guys come along, it just makes all that much more difference to me. And just, you know, having you here and enjoying this game is just uh, top notch. You know, I love it. But uh, hit that subscribe button if you haven't done so already. And hit that like. Also, comment down in the comment section. Let me know what you guys think about this game, you know, uh, so far. Uh, we got quite a ways to go. Things are really happening and starting to open up to us. So it's, it's going to get crazy. Yeah, it's going to get crazy up in here. Uh, find more information in the description as well as where to purchase it and also to play the demo. Of, and uh, we will see you on the next one. You take care now and bye bye.